this video, I'm going to be showing you the top five best class setups to use inside of Call of Duty Vanguard. So, let's get into it. So, here are the top five best class setups to run inside of Call of Duty Vanguard. So, we have the Volkster Mequire. Sure. For the muzzle, I'm going to be rocking the MX Silencer for that plus one sound suppression and for that plus one accuracy. For the barrel, I'm going to be rocking the Cross the Neck 428mm 05B, which we get highly accurate and controllable, reduced scope, sway, and gun bob and damage range. For the optic, I'm going to be rocking the Slate Reflector, but you can run whatever type of optic you want in the game. For the stock, I'm going to be rocking the SA Converted for that plus two sprint to fire time and that plus one movement speed. For the proficiency, I'm going to be rocking Steady. For the kit, I'm going to be rocking Fully Loaded, just so we start off with max starting ammo. For the rear grip, I'm going to be rocking tape grip, which is plus three aiming stability and that plus one weapon swap quickness. For the magazine, I'm going to be rocking the 8mm Curse 60 round drum, just so we have more bullets in our magazine. For the ammo top, I'm going to be rocking the lengthen for that plus three bullet velocity, and for the underbarrel, I'm going to be rocking the carver four grip for that plus two recoil control and that plus one hip fire accuracy. Next, we have the STG 44. For the muzzle, I'm going to be rocking the MX silencer for that plus one sound suppression and that plus one accuracy. For the barrel, I'm be rocking the cross to nick 620 millimeter precision for that highly accurate and controllable in the headshot damage the optic me rocking the slate reflector for the stock me rocking the vv 34s weighted for that plus four aiming stability plus three recoil control plus three accuracy and that plus two flinch resistance for the proficiency i'm be rocking nerves of steel for that plus one accuracy and recoil while injured or suppressed for the kit i'm be rocking fully loaded just so i start up max starting ammo at the beginning of the game for the rear grip i'm be rocking the tape grip for that plus three aiming stability and that plus one weapon swap quickness. But for the magazine, we're rocking the eight millimeter Kurtz 45 round drum just so we have more bullets in our magazine. For the ammo type, we're rocking lengthen for that plus three bullet velocity. And for the underbarrel, we're rocking the car with four grip for that plus two recoil control and that plus one hit fire accuracy. Next, we have the M1928. For the muzzle, we're rocking the F8 stabilizer for that plus two accuracy and plus one damage range. The bear will be rocking the, the Tariot 5.5 inch for that less damage fall off at long range and increased limb damage. For the optic, I'm going to be rocking the slate reflector. For the stock, I'm going to be rocking the ragdoll T2 support for the plus three recoil control, plus three accuracy, plus two recoil recovery, and plus two flinch resistance. The proficiency, I'm going to be rocking steady. For the kit, I'm going to be rocking fully loaded. For the rear grip, I'm going to be rocking taped grip for that plus three aiming stability and that plus one weapon swap quickness. For the magazine, the .45 ACP 100 round drum just so I have more magazine. And honestly, that is the best magazine to run for the M19. For the ammo type, I'm gonna be rocking LinkedIn for that plus three bullet velocity. And for the underbarrel, I'm gonna be rocking the M1930 Strive Angled. For that plus two accuracy, plus one aiming stability, and plus one aim blocking steadiness. Next, we have the MP40, which is the best SMG to run ever since its Vanguard came out. For the muzzle, I'm gonna be rocking the M1929 Silencer for that plus one sound suppression and plus one accuracy. Barrel with the VDD 100 89 millimeters short for that less damage fall off at long range and increased limb damage. For the optic, we'll be rocking the slate reflector. The stock, we'll be rocking the VDD 34M padded for that plus three recoil control, plus three accuracy, plus two flinch resistance, and plus one recoil recovery. For finish CM, we'll be rocking brace, kit fully loaded, rear grip, taped grip. Magazine 9mm 64 round drum just so I have more bullets in my magazine. The ammo type lengthen for that plus three bullet velocity and underbarrel the M1930 stripe angle for that plus two accuracy, plus one aiming stability, that plus one aim walking steadiness. Next, and definitely last but not least, we have the Type 100, which let me tell you, this is probably one of the best SMGs in the game. It could overtake the MP40. For the muzzle, I'm gonna be rocking the M1929 silencer for that plus one sound suppression and that plus one accuracy. For the barrel, I'm gonna be rocking the Shiro. Hirashi 374 millimeter for that recoil control and accuracy, reduced scope sway and gun bob and flinch resistance. For the opting, we'll be rocking the slight reflector. Stock, I'm we'll be rocking the water bachi grip folding for that plus form a walking movement speed, plus form a walking steadiness, and that plus one initial accuracy and recoil. Efficiency, vital, kit fully loaded, rear grip, tape magazine, 30 round magazine for that plus three bullet velocity and range, plus two bullet and penetration, and plus two damage. Ammo type link them for that plus three bullet velocity and on a barrel the M1930 strike angle for that plus two accuracy plus one aiming stability and that plus one aim walking setting. So yes people that is the top five best class setups to run inside of Call of Duty Vanguard. If you guys enjoyed today's video make sure to subscribe and peace out.